Hey guys. This light's probably going to go off in a minute. Oh shoot. It'd be nice if you could see me. I'm getting my, yep, there it goes. Into the bliss of darkness. Let me put a little bit of light. Let me put you in the seat. That ain't going to work either. Darn it. Yeah. And then there was that. Welcome back, guys. So I am, oh my lord, that's my husband. I kill him, I swear. All right, I'm on my way down to my girl Jen's. I am going to do some footage down there um, to show everybody that reptiles and rodents actually can get along. <laughs> so Jen is from Reptical Rodent Rescue. She is a rodent rescue that I have been network with, networking with for many years now. Um, we help each other out. We do venues together sometimes. Um, we both make oddity stuff. And at the same time, um, if I get live rats that are pets or guinea pigs and stuff in, she takes them. She's also housing my skinny pigs, which are my hairless guinea pigs. So I get to go see my babies um, for the winter months. Um, and uh, so she does a lot of um, chinchillas, hamsters, anything rodent, uh, guinea pigs, rats. Um, and, uh, you know, we don't feed live food, so we get a lot of animals that come in as pets that um, obviously we're not going to feed off, so we, we bring them to Jen. So I'm going to take you down to the rescue. Hey, guys. So I'm, I'm back, and I am down to Jen's at Rastical Rodent Rescue. Um, as I was telling you on my way down here, um, I wanted to come down and show you something else besides uh, reptiles. And reptiles and rodents actually can go well together. And we have been networking for quite a few years. Um, I bring her rats I get in sometimes, guinea pigs. Again, she has my skinny pigs housed here for the winter. And um, so I wanted to, it might be a little dark and hard to see, but you guys have seen Jen before. Usually she has green hair. Yeah, usually. <laughs> I know, right? And a voice. And a voice. So I'm going to um, turn this around. I want to show you a little bit of the rescue um, when I come in. If you have a light, you can turn it on. Um, so... Uh, this section in the middle here is uh, the rescue. And then she has, like, a, I told you she does the oddity stuff too um, from some of the guys that passed away here too. Um, she has a, a, stu a studio in the other part. All right, so there's all the critters. Well, not all of them, but uh, she just threw a bunch of hay in there for them guys because they like to forage at night. Um, so there's different levels. We actually moved this a couple months back. Um, she has guinea pigs coming in from uh, different shelters and individuals. And, uh, hi guys. This is one of my favorites. This is Walter. Hi, Walter. Walter, ha what does he have? Like a neurological? Yeah, he has neurological. A but he's such a sweetie pie. He is a sweetie pie. Hi, Walter. Walter, you want to bite him in the cheese? Here comes yeah. Walter. Walter. He's like, wait, what are you doing? <laughs> there goes Wal Walter's running. So, yeah, they. I'm surprised they don't all didn't start squeaking. Yeah. So, Jen yeah. gets overwhelmed down here. Um, yeah. huh, a little overwhelmed. Oh, and we hear some squeaking. So, she had some, some, uh, some babies born. She's had a few. Here's some little nuggets. Look at these cute little nuggets. So, she got, how many uh, moms did you get, pregnant moms at the same time? Five, it was. Yeah, all pregnant. Oh, look, they're popcorning. We basically had um, 15 born between the 28th and the 2nd. That's a lot. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're popcorning. So mm -hmm. these, uh, so she's had some babies born here. Some are in foster. She's got guinea pigs back here. Um, and then uh, in this other section, she's got guinea pigs here. She's got them in the hallway, <laughs> which I'm not going to turn the light on. Not in the all. But this is all guinea pigs set up. And then these are uh, the rats. So she has all the rats in nice uh, separated in cages and, and by colonies because they're herders. Colony animals. Yeah, they're colony animals. These so, are herders. I know I do that all the time. I always say it makes yeah. them okay. the same thing. Hi, guys. Hi. She has chinchillas too, by the way. Hi. So um, I'm going to leave a description and a link below. And you can go to rat with the T, Rectical Rodent Rescue on Facebook. Follow her, message her. She has chinchillas up for adoption. She has rats up for adoption. She'll have guinea pigs up for adoption. Um, hi, guys. We just gave all the chins raisins, so they're looking for some more. <laughs> yeah, but you guys can only have so many. 
Um, she has everything from hairless to gumbos and all different types. I don't know much about rodents, but she does. So you can always um, give her a call. Hi guys. I like. She likes the naked ones. All the nakies. She also makes um, all of these hammocks you see that are kind of hanging. Oh, look at them too. How cute. <laughs> you guys are cute up there. So all of these hammocks you see, she actually makes those too. So she does, like me, a bunch of different stuff. All kinds of goodies. So guys, there's a lot that goes into rescue and there's a lot that's needed. You can also go to Amazon. She has a wish list on Amazon under Radical Rodent Rescue also. So you can always send her donations that way. If you don't want to do financial, you can always do supplies. Huh? Say we need some supplies. Oop, that's too close. Say we need supplies. <laughs> I know. Look at this. What do you want? <laughs> or cages. You can always donate cages. There's always a need for those. Hi. Want to say hi? Oh, look at that cute one. Oh. <laughs> These guys are so soft. What? What? Oh, my God. You guys are chilly. Chilly, chilly. I'm jealous. I'm chilly, jealous chilly. Hi. I'm chilly. Someone else is oh, me. hang on. I know. Oh, no, we can't jump out. <laughs> no jumping out. <laughs> All right, guys. So I wanted to show you a little bit of the, the rescue down here at Rectical Rodent Rescue. Again, we've been networking for a long time. Just because it's rodents doesn't mean that reptiles and rodents can't coexist. They do. Not in the same cages, of course. <laughs> I don't want people to think I'm like, oh, we're putting yeah. rodents in cages. No, but um, different types of rescues can definitely work together. So, again, I'll leave a description and a link below. You can go follow her on Facebook, um, check out her page, and you can always message her if you're interested in adopting one of these cute little people, one of these cute little people, one of these cute little critters, mm -hmm. guinea pig or a rat or, or even a chinchilla. She has hamsters, too, from time to time. I have three of them. Oh, she has three right now. Hammies. she got hammies. Hi. Come here. I know. Uh, all right, Walter. Say goodbye, everybody. Say bye, Walter. Oops, it's a little fuzzy. All right, guys. Until next time, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until then, see you later, alligator. Say bye, guys.